Inaugurated by President Museven in Logazi, the plant was contracted to manufacture concrete slippers that will replace steel made slippers. The plant has since then attracted educational tours from the public to explore the various stages of slipper manufacturing. A delegation from Uganda Institute of Professional Engineers have attested to the timeliness of these slippers, saying they will boost rail transport. Concrete has lower maintenance. When it comes to, to safety, it can... Uh, it cannot easily be uh, tampered with. There are lots of things to learn from here, especially for the upcoming projects. We, we've seen the advantages and disadvantages, but of course the advantages outweigh the disadvantages. The concrete slippers are the most suitable technology in modern railways for meter gauge and standard gauge rail option, mainly because of their safety, comfort, speed, less vandalism, among others. Concrete slippers have a, a weight of 190 kilos. It's more heavy and they give to the track more durability and stability. Means this is more, more comfort in the way, more security. And uh, this is the reason that they live more even. There are not corrosion and they are Basically, they are more heavy and they are stressed, they are compressed, means they are special for dynamic load. When you add whatever you studied in class, you add it with this, immediately you can catch up. So they gave us enough training. We have staff, like you saw, 99.9 .9 is Ugandan and all of them are trained. With supervision or without supervision, they can produce this slipper. The plant, which is set to complete the manufacture of slippers required for the Kampala Nama the Mukono Railway line, has the capacity to supply slippers for the whole rehabilitation works the railway is undergoing. Mary Namkose, UBC News.